we go. Hi everybody! Welcome back to Storytime with Miss Megan and Miss Stephanie. I'm Miss Megan. I've missed you guys for the past couple of weeks. Miss Stephanie's been doing your crafts and she has done a great job. I bet you guys had a lot of fun doing your crafts. So this week for Storytime, we're talking about something really cool and special. What time of year is it, guys? That's right, it's Christmas time! So we had so much fun at our Christmas story time with you all, and I can't wait to see you guys again uh, at the library. Um, our next story times will be virtual entirely, so we'll have longer videos for you, but we'll still bring you lots of fun books and activities, and we'll still have crafts for you to pick up here at the library. Speaking of crafts, let's do our craft for this week. We talked about Christmas, and we read some Christmas books, so we are going to make ourselves a reindeer hat. Lots of fun, right? This is a really easy one for you guys, and it's going to be lots of fun for you to wear, and I want to see pictures of all of you in your reindeer hats when you're done. All right, so in your bag, you'll have everything you need except for, as usual, our trusty glue stick. So you have two strips of brown that will make your headband. You have two antlers. You have two pieces of greenery for your holly and three little holly berries. You have two ears, and you have the two little pink parts that go inside the ears. So to start out, you're going to take your two strips of paper, and you're just going to glue them together to make the full headband. Some of you might be little enough that you only need to use one, and that's just fine. I, however, have a adult size head, so I needed two. All right, so once those are glued together, your next step is going to be to glue down your antlers. So we'll just put a little bit of glue on the bottom. And you can either glue them to the back or to the front. So since I put the glue on the side that has the um, Sharpie traced on it, we're going to glue these to the back. All right. So we've got one antler on, and we're just going to do the other real quick. And you can do them as close together or as far apart as you want. So here we go. We have two antlers on our headband. All right, so next we're going to put our ears together. You're going to take one of your little pink pieces and one of your little brown pieces that look weirdly like Christmas lights. They're ears, I promise. And we're going to put glue on the back of the pink piece and put it right smack in the middle. And there, now it looks like an ear and not a Christmas light. And we're going to repeat that. So that we have two ears. And they are going to go right in front of where your antlers are. So we're going to put the glue on the back of the piece this time. Because it needs to go on the outside of the headband instead of the inside. like this. Mm -hmm. Okay, so last we're going to make some holly. So you're going to take your two green pieces and put glue on the back, just down at the bottom so that it sticks together good, but you don't want the whole piece to be sticky or you're going to get glue in your hair. And that doesn't sound good. And we're going to come and in front of one of the ears, we're just going to stick both of those green pieces down. So it looks like our reindeer has holly in front of his ear. So once your green pieces are down, like so, you're going to take your three little circles and just do the same thing. This is a fun one that you guys should all be able to do on your own. But if you do need help, that is okay. We are all about asking for help over here. One, two, and three. And Voila! We have reindeer antlers! Ta-da! And to secure the back, you can either glue it to the shape of your head or you can use some tape, um, however you want to do that. And as always, this is your reindeer hat, so you can do the pieces however you want. If you want to scatter holly berries all along, you do exactly what you want and make it unique. We look forward to seeing you guys again, and we want to see you all come in and get some books and get your crafts for next, our next story time here at the Terrell County Public Library. Have a happy holiday and we'll see you guys later.